so I'm looking at the jewelry and the owner who's in her pajamas <laughs> like it's like a hot mess over there um, she comes over and she puts this hat up on display and I'm just like yes I like didn't even look at the price I was like I will take that from you <laughs> because look at this it has iridescent black feathers with rhinestones gold deep I I just I just can't Hey you guys, what's going on? My name is Rachel, AKA Lilyworks, and I am a full-time stay-at-home mom, part-time reseller on multiple platforms. And today I have another haul. I went to St. Vincent de Paul, which is not like my normal stop, but they do sell jewelry and I found some really great shoe deals. Um, I did not record in the store. So you guys are just getting the haul afterwards just got done recording my Goodwill haul so let's get into this haul. the receipt here we go I paid $69.13 for everything I'm about to show you I think I got some really great deals I didn't know if there was like a tag sale like a color tag since this was only my second time in there they had just opened and I didn't see any signs but I overheard while I was shopping that there was a green tag sale and I was like oh there's a lot of things in my cart that have green tags so let's start off with some shoes. Green tag. These were originally $5.99. So a little bit cheaper than my Goodwill by me. As you can see. Um, well, there we go. $5.99. These are just some Clarks. Are they, oh no, these are Danskos. Okay, they look like Clarks, don't they? But these are some Danskos. These are a little bit different than the regular like nursing or chef's clogs. They are a clog style with a ankle strap, closed toe, very cute. And they do have a little bit of like alligator or croc embossed details. And I was happy to find these and these were half off of $5.99. So $3, yay. Okay, next, these are possibly for resale. Ooh, some shoes are gonna fall on the floor. Possibly for resale, but most likely these are going to my friend Alyssa. So. My friend Alyssa and I, we go to spin class, trying to get more friends uh, involved because it is way more fun to do spin class with people with you. Um, so she does spin class with me and she was asking um, about the biking shoes that go into, that clip into um, the spin pedals. And uh, yeah, you want to look for <laughs> biking shoes that have the clips these are them right there and what I was told from our spin spin instructor is that you clip them in and you can't like you spin um, and they your feet will not um, slip off of the pedals unless you twist your foot a certain way and then they will um, release from the pedal a lot of people have these there's he said that it was like less work pulling up pushing down when you when you use these you don't need to use these shoes but um yeah so she was looking for shoes these are size seven and a half which are her size she might need an eight possibly but we will i was happy to find these for her only for 5.99 if they don't fit her i'm going to resell these these biking cleats always do really well especially if they have the um little clip already attached to it so that was I was so happy to find the find those for her so she can try them out and not have to pay a buttload of money All right next here's the jewelry did get some jewelry you guys next I paid $6.99 for these and I thought these were really nice these are like a suede but they're like a leopard or cheetah print with this little circle zipper and these are by the brand lucky brand yes 
And now the Lucky Brand boots do better than the other types of shoes. Um, I feel like the boots are a little bit higher of quality and their purses. Anything that's like leather basically from Lucky Brand does better. Um, but yeah, these are cute, trendy, and I think that these are just so fun with that animal print on there. So I grabbed those. Okay, so this is so funny. Green tag, yay. So you can see these green tag. These are some really cute retro style cap toe. So you can see there's a cap right here. That's where there's a seam right along the top. Lace up booties with little heels. These are like really um, cute office shoes. And what's funny is someone had picked them up at Goodwill for $12.99. And then I got them half off. Um, for $6.99 so like three bucks and these are still in pretty great shape even though they've been recycled a couple times and that makes me happy yay all right here is another brand that I have sold a few times and it, it doesn't sell quickly but it is a nicer brand and you'll be surprised so the brand is Beautifeel Beautifeel and you might be like, that doesn't look like something I would pick up. There's leather right here on the soles. Then it goes into rubber. These are just really high quality um, shoes. Like the, it's leather, but it's cushioned leather um, insoles. And let's see, European size 40. So like a nine or a nine and a half. Again, look up that brand and you'll be surprised at comps. You might think, okay, I'm not picking these up, but like $30 plus, I'm okay with that. And I paid $5.99 for these. I think I have some Beauty Feel boots, booties listed for like 80 bucks or something. And I've been getting a few watchers on those. So yeah, uh, I thought these were, oh yeah, made in Israel. That was a thing. These are made in Israel. So nice, nice quality. These I paid full price for $5.99, but again, Merrell's. Merrell's, I think, are cooling down a little bit. Like, the market might be getting a little bit more saturated. I still pick them up if they're in great shape, and these are. These are some women's mules, and I've sold this style plenty of times. So I'm happy to pay $6 for these. I can get, like, 30 bucks for these mules. Okay. So I'm looking at the jewelry and right above me are all these hats that um, the that they're like on display above the jewelry so I'm looking at the jewelry and the owner who's in her pajamas <laughs> like it's like a hot mess over there um, she comes over and she puts this hat up on display and I'm just like yes I like didn't even look at the price I was like I will take that from you <laughs> Because look at this. It has iridescent black feathers with rhinestones. Gold. De I, I just, I just can't. It's like 80s Oprah <laughs> or something. I don't, I, I don't know. But it, my head is really big. Um, so I cannot even show you the beauty. <gasps> and it's green tag. How did they just put this on the floor and it's green tag? $1.99. So I got this for 99 cents. Okay, what does it say on the inside? It says 100% wool made in USA. So this is a vintage hat. I just, I just, I just, this is so beautiful. Okay, maybe not Oprah, but what am I thinking of? <clears throat> you know the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, the mom. <laughs> I feel like maybe she would wear this. Like it just like is so black and gold chic big 80s chic gold tone puffy door knocker earrings or button earrings I don't know I just have it all pictured in my mind yes okay let's get into the belts and I was really glad about the belts as well oh half off of 49 cents this is so good I'm so happy okay this does need some Doc Martens balsam this is the brand Brighton right there Brighton this is a men's belt the khaki 
cording is stretch and the leather needs some help so that's why they price it low but just clean it up with the Doc Martens and that does wonders. I am so happy about that one. Another half price off of 99 cents and this one is a stretch belt. It is the limited so gen or synthetic leather so not genuine leather but really really cute waist belt with stripes and got that one and then this one was the last one this one does not have a brand oh half off of 49 cents again wow this was my day okay so let's see this one says genuine top grain cowhide interesting it doesn't feel like that nice of quality but I don't know so this one's fun where you buckle it underneath and then this lies on top so it basically looks like you don't even have like holes in your belt so that's fun um, I think this looks to be vintage and again I got this for half off of 49 cents all right <clears throat> jewelry these were 3.99 earrings oh these are so pretty these are some signed trifari vintage earrings they do have pierced backings and they are signed trifari on the back and they just feel like really smooth high quality costume earrings look at these rivolis they, this these earrings look just like the brooch that um watermelon rivoli rhinestone brooch that i showed you guys in one of my hauls these are clip-ons and they are glorious i'm wondering if these are like juliana maybe possibly they're not signed juliana jewelry is not signed um but i don't know maybe they are kind of want to wear these now like not my style, but you know me, I need to put on <laughs> my ridiculous earrings. And these I paid $2.99 for. All right, so there we go. Okay, moving on, $5.99. This one is going to be mine for a little bit. Maybe I could wear it with this outfit. I love this. I don't know if this is 70s or what, but it's totally giving me retro hippie boho vibes with the long gold tone pendant. And then these are blue glass beads. Um, I don't know. It says made in something, but again, $5.99. I love this. Like I love that turquoise look. And so it kind of looks like boho. Love it. Okay. Next, I got these for $1.99. Oh, these are, okay, I need to list these quickly. These are peng cloisonne penguins with little hearts for $1.99 for Valentine's Day. So that will be so stinking adorable. And again, a lot of cloisonne earrings have this textured backing to it. And they're hook earrings. This I got for $2.99. And I liked this because it was like a genuine, um, well, I, I guess I should just say it was a like metal chain with um, like mint green beads woven around it. So it's like nice and thick. And it does have a snail shaped box clasp right here. It is marked Avon. I've been doing well with Avon lately, so I grabbed this guy for $2.99. I like the colors, I like the quality, I like the box clasp, so there was some good things going for it. These I got for $2.99. I hear a little honey head, hold on. Some clip-on earrings, and they are absolutely gorgeous. Just hold them still. They have like a faux pearl and an antiqued gold tone, rhinestone cluster. These are clip-on. They didn't have a price, but I think they charged me $2.99. These were also $2.99. Okay, I'll hold these up for you, okay? So these are these 
Noah's Ark earrings. And they are marked 925 on the back. So they are marked something 925. So sterling silver, Noah's Ark earrings, which are like novelty. And I remember, I just have to show you guys. Just hold on. Don't mind my, oh, my hat. If my hat fit me, I would just be all, just be the whole look, right? Um, Annalise wants to show you more. Oops. It's okay. <clears throat> Here, hold this in your hand. So when I was going to the Ark Encounter with the family, I had some, um, I had a Noah's Ark brooch in my inventory. I totally wore that loud and proud. I do have a Noah's Ark big giant brass pendant necklace in my store if anybody wants it. It's, it's in my eBay, eBay store. Um, yeah, here, let's show what you just held up. Not those ones, these ones. So these are super sweet clip-ons. And anybody, anybody, can you guess the maker? Now can you guess the maker? <laughs> that swirling in the back tells you that it is 1928. And 1928 jewelry does have a nice following. They make brooches. I think I actually have the brooch in my store right now that matches this. Maybe even a couple of brooches. I think I have one where it's like a bar brooch with a chain and then it hangs down. And yeah, so we have that one. I think we already showed that one on Elise. Okay, here are some crown trifari clip-ons and look at how beautiful. I feel like I don't see crown trifari with silver toned jewelry that often. These kind of have an art deco vibe. And Gideon's sad because Annalise is in here with me and he's not. He's with Daddy. <laughs> but these were just really pretty for $1.99. And then two more. So uh, I don't remember the price on these and there's no tag. But these, look at how beautiful this purple is. Really rich royal purple toned cloisonne wave earrings can't leave cloisonne behind i love it and then lastly we have these these are marked avon on the backing i'm gonna have to screenshot to make sure what does it say 2.99 for these but these are totally art nouveau vibes to me and they're pierced so pretty so yeah. Yes, so pretty. Last lady. And those, yes, those are pretty. Annalise really likes wearing clip. Oh, you want to wear these ones? Look at, look, look at my ear. Look at. Do you want to wear these? Here. Okay. All right. Look pretty and also the There we go. So mine and mine. Oh, that's stuff. Yep. Alright, here you go. Aren't they beautiful? This would be, whoa, stained So, yeah. In my pocket. So, that, can you believe I got all of that for $69.13? Yay! Um, so, I am looking forward to starting to list that. I got a variety of stuff. So, shoes, yay. Belts, easy. Jewelry, beautiful. Fills that, uh... <laughs> Um, need for beautiful antique and, and vintage I'll things bring these in too. my heart. Um, I'm hoping this little honey I... head doesn't start stealing the jewelry. All right, Annalise, let's wrap up this video. Here, up here. Say, if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And make sure you're out there thrifting so you can live generously. And I see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Oh, I wanted to say before, I am hovering around 900 subscribers. So, yeah, if you are not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. I would be so happy that you are joining our... Which button? Not that one. Don't hit those buttons. It's down below. Um, hit the subscribe button down below and join our family. Uh, the this reseller homeschooling mama family <laughs> that sells jewelry yeah. and shoes and yeah. uh yeah once i hit a thousand subscribers i will be monetized so i'll see you guys next time <laughs> bye guys <laughs>